Let's start the show, everyone. I'm very late today because I just discovered that what I thought was an amazing mod to my Famicom was actually just because of my own poor soldering skills, another unforeseen challenge on the road to having an AV Famicom that can use an NES zapper. I don't know what happened, but I cannot use the controller one port successfully or consistently. When I have when I when I soldered two points together, because as I mentioned in the last episode of um, the J Contra Dojo, the AV Famicom does not have the proper connections between its controller 2 port and the system itself to be used with the zapper because the Famicom gun originally entered through a port on the side of the Famicom. The original Famicom controllers were hardwired. So in order to use the gun, you had to plug it into this little port on the side. It was like this 15 pin monstrosity as opposed to the eight pins, ah, I missed. As opposed to the eight pins that are this, that are used by this here zapper gun. Now I recently discovered that for about $20, you can buy a special adapter that will allow you to use zapper guns and NES controllers with the Famicom, both the AV Famicom, Twin Famicom, and of course the original Famicom. So these next few dojos are going to be focusing on zapper gun game, zapper gun games for the Famicom. Right now we are right in the middle of the year 1984, which should be about June. That is when a game called Hogan's Alley comes out for the Famicom. And it's actually very interesting because apparently Hogan's Alley was like this training area that the FBI had in Virginia or whatever. And that's where you learn to shoot stuff. And it's, it's falling into something that I noticed when I was playing the other day, but with these first three zap gun games, you're not actually killing human beings. You killed plenty of ducks, but when it comes to shooting human beings in here, See, I'm already a pro at this. I'm already a pro at target practice. That is essentially what this is. Although Wild Gunman is a little bit different, but we'll get to that probably um, very soon. My plan right now is to get through the first three Zap Gun games. We already played Duck Hunt, although Wild Gunman was the first one to come out. It was Wild Gunman, Wild Gunman, then Duck Hunt, then Hogan's Alley. I just decided to go with Duck Hunt because it is obviously the much more famous of the light gun games. However, Wild Gunman did have its time to shine in Back to the Future Part 2. Right now we're playing game A. This is a very simple um, target set where you have three targets. One of them... I thought maybe Hogan was the police officer. <laughs> I thought that's the Hogan that the game was referring to. I have no idea. I don't have the manual, so I cannot confirm if that is true or not. What I can tell you is that most often of the three targets, one will be a police officer, one will be a lady or an old man, and the other will be a violent gang member. Because remember, this is the 1980s, People are scared as shit of gangs, violence. We think super criminals are coming. We're waiting. We're like, the 1990s is going to be a criminal hellscape. And that's why we need games like Hogan's Alley to train the children of the future. Who will hopefully not become super criminals and use their skills for evil. But instead will use them for good in hunting down these low-life criminal scum. 
That's what the game is saying, not me. Of course, obviously, that the criminal wave, the super criminal wave of the 1990s turned out to be for naught. However, all of the laws um, that tried to prevent that super, the super crime from happening still remain on the books and are punishing people unfairly. And I believe I've just disqualified myself from most major political offices by that statement. But I would never run for office anyways. <laughs> Did I miss? What? Bullshit. Come on, game. No, that was nonsense. Shit, we're already on round 33? Easy sauce. Now you think I, it must be ran. It, it's gotta be pretty random, because at least with Duck Hunt. Oh, that was. Oh, that was tricky. The thing is, the old man. When you see the lady in the pink dress, you're like, that's not a super criminal. I mean, she could be a super criminal. I'm not making any judgments about people. Whoa! Point six of a second. What? What? Sometimes I've noticed two criminals will show up, but that seems to be particularly rare. And I don't know why. Ah, damn it. It's, you know, I see that guy because the old man has a brown, like, he's got a brown color palette and so does one of the evil criminals. Oh, come on. Game. <laughs> That's it. No. Haven't heard any civilians yet. <laughs> the policeman is distinct. The lady wearing the pink uh, top is very distinct. Old man, he's a trickster. I feel like he's in on it. I think the one second is fine. I could do, I mean, I think in Wild Gunman, I had a pretty fast reaction time. I was getting like 0.4s. Let's see, ooh, I wonder if we can get to like 99. I wonder what happens when we get to 100. I don't know, maybe it's a 10 misses. The game decides we're a loser and we can't play anymore. I don't know, let's find out what happens. That's the whole reason I'm playing the game is to see what happens. What? No. Bullshit. Ah, <laughs> uh, two of them. There we go. It not only tests your accuracy, it also, whoa, 0.7, it's a 0.7, so the 0.6 and 0.7 is what I can't handle. But remember, this is a test not, it's is a more, I think it's more a test of reaction time than anything else. Not particularly accuracy, although I do seem to miss every once in a while. No matter how much I think it's bullshit. <laughs> You know, you see all these uh, MLG level players, they're playing their, uh, they're playing PUBG, they're playing Overwatch, they're playing point and click adventure games. I'm playing the real deal right here. You gotta aim and shoot with your hands. Not with a keyboard, not with a mouse, but with a gun. With a gun. Look at that. You see that shit? Point seven. Two targets in point seven. Seven tenths of a second. You know, the old man looks like he's up to something. It looks like he's holding something. I think that's what freaks me out. Oh, shit. Oh, man. I almost killed the old man. Oh, goddamn. Eyes are drying out because of the heater. Mm. 
So it's about to get very cold here. It's been very cold the last couple of days, if I want to date this here broadcast. But it's freezing! God, I hope I, I hope the game freaks out once we reach level 99. That's... Oh, no! Oh, no! Ah, oh, there it is, the 10. I said, we might come back. We'll see. We'll go. We'll spice things up. Nope. Come on. There we go. I think our goal here, I mean, look, this is the dojo. We don't necessarily have to get to it today, but we're gonna try and hit that round 99. I could be in the FBI. I'm so professional at all video games. Isn't life just a video game with better graphics? Therefore, I am professional at life. I killed the old man! Ah! Good, you killed the old man. Good. Good. <gasps> what happens if we get to round 10? All right, well, I guess for this game B, we're going to round 10, baby. Keep assuming it's going to be criminals. See, I can't, I can't be, I can't, I got to do less than one per round or I'm toast. They won't let me into the academy. Look at that shit. Professional. Look at that shit. Oh my god. Oh, damn it. I didn't think they'd do two in a row. I didn't think they would do two in a row. That is insane. Oh my god. Gotta up my game. Holy crap. Uh oh. Color change. They're coming faster. Oh my god. Oh, now I just feel bad for myself. That's just embarrassing. He flipped, he came out and he flipped! What other surprises does this game have in store for us? Wow, so if you miss? Huh, that's interesting. Interesting. So I guess if you miss, they just automatically flip around and just pounce.
That's why I don't miss. Good. It's good. Oh no! Ah, oh, I missed. And I killed the old man. Oh my god, now I just feel bad. Internet, help me! Oh my god! There's so many civilians! <laughs> I did not account for that many civilians. Alright, let's do trick shot. Trick shot's actually kind of fun. We'll only do it once. We'll go back to the other one. To the other modes next. But trick shot is very interesting. Whoa! Oh, look at that shit. Five thousand freaking points. <laughs> oh my god, did you see that shit? Two ten thousand points? Oh my god, that's way better than my practice rounds. Holy shit. Sometimes you just gotta, you gotta get those cans in. Like, yeah, we all want the 5,000, but... You just gotta make it happen. You gotta make it happen. That's what's it. That's the business. No, miss! It's when it gets to that edge. That's when we have a problem. Easy. That's right. Sharp shooter. You think they let? An Do you think they give amateurs the title of sharpshooter? I don't think so. Look at that juggling, juggling these cans. display oh. whatever oh my god look at that skill Baby, come out. Come out. Come out. There it is. 
Okay, what happens round 10? What happens? What happens? What happens? Oh, it's just 10. We get rid of the R. Yeah. Let's challenge ourselves, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to start getting those 5,000s. We're going to start doing it. Uh oh Oh, oh, the misses. The misses! Ah! Oh. It's when it... I don't know. It must be when it gets down to that little... I think the menu counts as a miss. That's the danger zone, ladies and gentlemen. And 100 points? I should get more points for landing it on that little... Uh, Mario's platform right there. Come on. Nah, not gonna happen. Sometimes you just get caught in a loop and you don't... You don't want to get trapped. You just gotta get out of there. It's like a roundabout. You could be there forever, but what's the point? Good. Good! into the 5,000 point mark. You believe that shit? Oh my god. It's gonna happen. Nah, not gonna happen. Not gonna happen. Oh. Called it. <laughs> I may have lost, but at least I was right. Oh. Oh my god. Whoa, that was a... Sometimes, the cans will double up. And you just, you just... Brainicus does not process that. You gotta shoot twice. Miss? That doesn't seem like me. Yeah. We'll go to round 20 on this. There's no reason we don't need to go round 100 on this. If there is even a round 100. But that's why we're playing the game. We're here to find out. There it is. There he is. <laughs> Done. All right, we'll complete round 20, then we'll move along. Okay, we're gonna give this one up. We've gotten Super Sharpshooter. I don't believe there's a higher distinction. So take us, Cans. Take us away, Cans! Here we go. A round! They give you so much time in the beginning. I think that's one of my issues with Hogan's Alley is that... 
like I want to I want to be challenged by the game, but to be challenged by the game, I have to go through all these this this boring beginners part. But look, this game came out 33 freaking years ago. Give it a break. <laughs> Was it 33 years ago? 30 would have been 2013. Yes, 35 years ago. Holy crap. Like, I mean, let's cut Nintendo a break. <laughs> oh, oh, two criminals down. Oh, I missed. Oh. It's on the edge. It's on the edge. A lot more double criminals this time around. Maybe it's just me. Old man. Oh my god, it's the brown outfit. The brown outfit. Oh, and that counts as two misses? Oh my god. So not only did I get a miss for not killing the the no the the ne'er do well. I also got a miss for killing the old man. You just gotta pick your you gotta point out, you have to in your mind. You have to identify your targets and blast them. I do wish it gave you a uh, your reaction time like it does. Oh, miss. Wild Gunman gives you your reaction time. I wish I wish it would do this, do it for this, so that you could compare it to the reaction time that they allot you. Like I believe that's what the top um, that top number represents. Like right in this round, I have 1.2 seconds to react. I think in Wild Gunman I was doing 0.36. I think that was my best reaction time. And I think when there were two people on the screen, I I ended up getting 0.5, point like 0.55 or 0.56. I want to say. We're at 25, we're a quarter of the way there. Here we go, here we go. See, I think it would make the game more interesting if they put in um, a row of non-criminals every once in a while. Because you're like, oh, I need to shoot something. I need to shoot, shoot something. But wait, I can't. What? Miss? No way. No way. I shot Hogan. I shot Hogan. Oh my god. Oh my god. Too this game is too fast. It's too fast and it's too furious.
no game. I. I. I mean, it's a poor craftsman who blames his tools or her tools. <laughs> but still, that was bullshit. I had iron sighted him and everything. They don't have scopes on the zapper. You gotta iron sight that shit. You gotta no scope. Each one of these hits is a no scope. Is that point seven? I'm man. That's what is slowing. You know, I think it's because it's the target identification that's slowing me down. All right, let's do the alley. Let's do the Hogan's alley. Oh my god! <laughs> First, oh no, no! Oh my god! I've been shot. I was so close to my retirement. Oh. 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 So wait, but this is interesting. This is actually something, um... I was curious to find out. I, I wanted to test for myself. But no, it's that when, when they flip, because sometimes I thought when they would flip, I thought they would just like flip. And they would go back, like, they would go, like, ooh, I'm, I'm, ooh, no, I'm hiding, I'm hiding now, and then I'm gonna come back. No, it's like, that's the only time you have. They don't come back. When they come back, they're dead. We're gonna do this over again, because I have discovered some things about my life. Now that I'm reborn after being shot ten times. Well, nine times, plus the time I shot the old man. Now we're doing it for reals. to breathe properly. That's what I gotta do. Ah! Oh, it's the moving ones. Oh, two on the seat. Ah! <laughs> see, man, they're, they're throwing out all the tricks at me. That's what's happening. You got two ones moving at the same time? Which one are you supposed to shoot first? I don't know. Oh my god, and I just, I knew it. I saw it, but my, my brain had already sent this signal to my finger to shoot. And it was all over for that old man. I mean, I've done better. I don't know if I'd qualify this as good. Look at that. Didn't kill any civilians yet. Ah! Oh. <laughs> and not even one second later, I kill the old man. Ooh, my finger twitched. Finger twitched.
Uh oh, we're in purple. We're in purple! I killed Hogan again! Oh my god! The gun shop. These are just, these could just be law-abiding citizens. They're at the gun shop. They're holding the guns. They're holding the things they want to purchase. This is a free country. Look there, I mean, there's only one guy who's actually like pointing it menacingly at you. Okay, maybe two of them. I don't think the guy wearing the brown jacket, I don't think he's that menacing. I think he's just, that guy's kind of menacing. He is pointing it at you. And then there's the gangster. But that guy, he's just like hanging out. The brown, the guy wearing brown why do you gotta shoot him because he doesn't have a haircut I killed Hogan again man it's Hogan Hogan always uh Hogan causes a lot of problems for me. I don't know if his name is actually Hogan. That's just what I'm calling him. I'm calling him Hogan, and I'm assuming that this is Hogan's alley. Like this area right here. That's just my assumption. The miss. Oh, the round 10 miss. Uh, okay, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna do each one of these. We're not gonna do trick shot. Trick shot is, you know, trick shot is trick shot. We're gonna see how far we can go through the target shooting, and then we're gonna go into the Hogan's Alley for a final time. And then we'll call it a stream. But who knows how long it could go on for. Criminals down. Is he holding like a like a football? I don't. The, my problem is that I'm too fast shooting these guys to where I don't get a good uh, I don't get a good view of them. I don't actually know what they're holding. The guy like the the guy with the sunglasses he could just be holding a watermelon. I don't even know if he's holding an actual gun. It's because I don't get to see him. Because the game is telling me he's a villain. I don't know if he's an ac actually a villain. I just know the game is telling me he's a villain. How am I supposed to trust the game? You don't know. Two again? Like the first time, the first time I was playing this, there was hardly any. But now I think it knows. It's like, we gotta pro play in this game. We gotta throw him a few more challenges just to make it interesting.
One second. One second for two guys? Whoa, game. Whoa, slow down. I think I like this more than I do Duck Hunt. Because with Duck Hunt, you just kind of shoot and you're like, there's not a lot of thought involved. It's just mostly accuracy. What I like about Hogan's Alley is you gotta think, you gotta think, oh, am I shooting the right thing? Am I shooting the right target? And am, am I not shooting a civilian? What about Hogan? I don't want to kill Hogan. There's a bit more thought involved, and I like that. Point seven seconds for two bad guys. What? Whoa. Almost shot Hogan there for a second. Point nine! Point nine! Holy crap. Oh, oh, game. Game. Getting too fast for me over there. Two misses. Oh my god, I'm losing. I'm losing my step. That wasn't a miss. No. I don't think so, game. I think that's just you saying, like, whoa, slow down there, buddy. I think this is what the game... I think that's what the game is trying to tell me. But I'm not slowing down. I'm not. Doing pretty good. We're almost at 50. We're almost at 50. But does it get... I wonder if we cross 50 if things start getting unreasonable. Duck Hunt, I think, started getting unreasonable. Because it wanted... It wanted perfect scores to continue. I think... What was it? Past round 20? I, I think we got to round 20 and it wanted you to shoot 10 out of 10 ducks. Like, look, I'm pretty good, but nobody's perfect, okay? I'm MLG. I'm not perfect. It's the sides. I don't know what it is about the sides. I think... I don't know if it's the TV, if it's the gun, but... For some reason, I think, you know, maybe it's when I go a bit too far into the side. I think that's what's happening. What? No way. No way. But we got to 50, so I don't mind. I don't mind. We did good. Personal best. Oh, I'm losing. Yeah. 
Nope. Losing it. I'm losing it. <laughs> I had the aim. I had the aim and I missed him. Oh, man. Well, I didn't miss him. I just didn't take the shot. That was my mistake. That was completely on me. But that one... I don't know. I think that's just the game saying, Jay Contra, you gotta, you gotta be done. But I'm not done because we're doing... Um, we're doing... We're doing the alley. We're doing Hogan's Alley. One final time. Here we go with the gun shop, just law-abiding American citizens exercising their Second Amendment right. But I guess we just have to kill them for some reason. And it says keep out, like, are we just invading their personal property? Like, why do we have to be breaking into where they... Two civilians in a row? On the first round? What? What game? What is going on? Come on, come on. I just, I knew it, and I couldn't even stop myself. Good. I mean, no. This is horrible. Should be zero misses. Zero. two in a row because I think the game I never I don't think that the game is going to try and fake me out but it always does oh I missed Okay, getting better, getting better. I'm not just a sharp sharpshooter. I am a super sharpshooter, and I wanted the game to recognize that. Ooh, that was close, old man. What are you doing in a place like this, Hogan? I know it's your alley. Thank you. 
Oh, I missed. Stay focused. I would like to get past purple. I'd like to see what the next color variant is. Good. Let's make it to five. Let's make it to five and I'm happy. But we'll see. I could lose it all in the very first part of the next stage. Miss! No, 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 no. Oh my god, that was okay. That was a legit miss. I can hold the two hands. Accuracy is greatly improved when you use two hands with the gun. Oh, I didn't time it right. That was my mistake. Hogan! No, I didn't think my final... Oh, my final miss would be killing Hogan. Well, I had a lot of fun playing Hogan's Alley. But I think we've gotten as much out of the game as we can for today. I would actually, you know... All the light gun games so far have been very fun. Duck Hunt is pretty fun. Hogan's Alley is really good, and I can't wait to show you Wild Gunman next. But for now, we're just going to keep it here. This has been Hogan's Alley. I have been Jay Contra. Remember, mastery, learning, growth. Those are the key words of the Jay Contra dojo. This has been Jay Contra saying thanks for watching, and mahalo.